Hey guys, I'm Carlos Torres. I'm the vertical sales rep for Benchmark 2 and Supply. Here to show you a little bit about the DTL scanner, site scans. So, once you set up on a known point, you would want to hit survey. You want to go site scan. And it's starting the scanner right now. You can hear it hum when it starts. Once you reach this screen, you will see scan type, scanning station, station name, image, scan resolution. So you would want to hit full dome if you want the whole 360, or if you just want to hit a certain area, you would hit area a bit. And this, we would want to hit full dome for this setup. Current occupation is where your known point is. And if you want images with the scan, you check your image box. And on scan re resolution, you would want to hit standard or fine, depending on how fine you want the resolution of your point cloud data. So for this scan, we're going to go fine. We're going to hit scan. And it will prompt a warning to make sure your lens cap is off. Come around and you see it's on. Pop it off. Another thing I would do is make sure your SD card is in there. So we got ours in there. Once you hit start, it will start to take the images and after that, it will start to scan. It takes three to five minutes and once it gets started, the total station will start rotating. After the scan is done, it will start loading the image and you can see it on the screen. It won't take but a couple of seconds. Once it's finished loading, you will see the scan on your data collector. You can zoom in, move around, check the scan out. After that, you would hit the check mark, top right hand corner. Site scan will now close. Have you measured all the points needed? Yes. Stop and scanner. And that's it. So if you would want to pick the scanner up to another location, you pick it up, set up in a different location on a known point and do the same process over again.